What the hell? Oh. Interesting. Cool. Oh. Chat. Chat. Wait, what is that for? Oh, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Um, hi, guys. Welcome to the stream. Uh, today, we're going to give the animals some pumpkins. I have three of these little guys and then three big ones. Um, that is the plan for today. But um, before we start stream... Hi, Ellie. Thanks for being here. Um, before we start the stream... Um, I am sponsored today uh, by Holskern. Um, you guys have seen seen the Holskern sponsors before. Um, they are very very cool. I'll show you. Oh, I'll show you their website. Do 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 do. They have watches, they have jewelry, they have purses, they have necklaces, bracelets, rings, sunglasses. Um, I got all of these from Holzkern and there's none of the jewelry in the boxes because I've been wearing them. And I brought them to TwitchCon and so they're still in my suitcase. But if you want to see my Holzkern jewelry or, um, or my Holzkern bag... Because they gave me a purse that's very cool. It's vegan leather, faux leather. Um, you can see them in my vlog, my TwitchCon vlog, that is coming out soon, hopefully. I voiced it over yesterday. Thanks. Um, so, yeah, haven't unpacked. I have not unpacked. Um, it's really bad. It's actually really stressing me out. Thank you for the 55 months. Um, so, 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 Holzkern. Thank you. Holzkern was founded as a small family business in Austria. Um, all of their products are partially made from natural materials. The cool thing about Holzkern, um, for me anyway, or one of the reasons that I was excited about partnering with them, is because all of their wood is FSC certified, um, which is the Forest Stewardship Council. Flip, can you focus on this monitor so I can show them? Um, can you guys see it? Here's some of the stuff. Wait, men's watches. You guys are men, probably. Wow, check these out. Cool. Enhance. Wow, amazing. That's good. Thank you. Um, thank you, Hammy. Um, FSC, Forest Stewardship Council, ensures that products come from responsibly managed forests that provide environmental, social, and economic benefits. Um, and all of their wood comes with this certification, which is cool, which is good. If you're going to buy wood products, it's definitely best... For them to be FSC certified, um, they started with watches, but now they have jewelry, sunglasses, uh, unique cases, which are those like purse bag things that I was talking about um, that I brought to TwitchCon. Um, and Holzkern means wood core in German. Kind of fun. Um, you guys can use code Maya15 or go to holzkern.com slash MayaHiga if you want to get something from there. You can also do command Holzkern. In chat. So yeah. And look at these. Boxes that. The stuff comes in. They're magnetic. Listen. Wow. ASMR. Tourmaline 123. Resubbed for 15 months. I dropped it. Wow. Amazing. Hooray. Cool. They're nice. 
They're nice, and they have a little, look at this. Beautiful. The necklace and earrings you wear from them are so pretty. I know. I wore um, both, actually. I wore a pair of earrings on Friday to TwitchCon, and I wore the necklace on Saturday to TwitchCon for both my meet and greets. So if you've seen any pictures from the meet and greets at TwitchCon, the necklace that I'm wearing in all of the pictures is, is Holzgren. Wood. Change the date on your table? Uh, no, it's correct. So actually, I'm going to leave it there. But thank you for trying. Will there be an Alves vlog at TwitchCon? No, we did not vlog for Alves at TwitchCon. But there will be a vlog on my channel. I did the voiceover for it yesterday. Um, so that is all. You guys can do command holes current in chat. Um, or you can use uh, code Maya15. Um, or holescorn.com slash mayahiga if you guys want to go check out some of that stuff. Um, holiday season is coming up, so it's cool to look at that. Uh, as gift gift potential, um, thank you, Holescorn, for sponsoring the stream today. Okay, that is all. Okay, age. All right, you guys. Um, we are going to do a keeping stream today. But I'm very stressed because tomorrow is the fall carnival. And here's the plan. Okay. Today, keeping stream where we give the animals pumpkins because it's fun and fresh. Um, so we're gonna give we're gonna give the animals pumpkins. I think maybe we we might do a stress test on the bingo board. I don't know. Um, jump scare for our web devs here. If <laughs> surprise, <laughs> we may do that. <laughs> maybe we do that. Um, maybe we uh, practice rings with Abbott. Maybe we practice the colander with. Um, with Oliver. Oh, I'm going to give you guys the run of show for tomorrow. Um, for the fall carnival, which is tomorrow, November 4th at 11 a.m. So this time, um, it starts with Oliver opening. Oliver's doing an opening. He's going to do cauldron. He has an evil wheel. Um, and... He's going to pick consequences for you guys out of the wheel. Then we have the rat maze. We set it up yesterday. I'm going to show you guys. It is sick. Okay, so we're going to do the rat maze. We have a grain eating contest with Winnie after that. So we're going to eat Cheerios and she's going to eat grain. Um, we'll see how that goes. Uh, then we have a roach race. I need to make that because I don't have a, a, a racetrack for the roaches at this moment. Um, and then bingo wow. after that. Tilios, up for 18 months. Blue. Tilios, thank you for the 18 months. Um, that's so random. That's such a random mean thing to say. Um, not moo. Moo is fine. You can say that if you want. Uh, bingo is after that. Oliver is going to pick bingo numbers. You guys are all going to have your own bingo boards. And if you win bingo, if you get a bingo, um, then you get points. The fall carnival tomorrow is all points. There will be a leaderboard. Okay? There will be a leaderboard. You can win the fall carnival. You can have the most points at the fall carnival. What happens if you win? Absolutely nothing uh, as of right now. Um, wow. but like how cool thank you for 28 months um, and then the last thing is a ring toss with Abbott um, it is on this channel tomorrow last thing is a ring toss with Abbott um, and Abbott is going to do his rings and you guys are going to compete against him and probably lose 
Pickled. Pickled Rick. Thank you for the two months. So today, um, this is going to be a shorter stream on my channel. Handing out pumpkins, that is it. Uh, and then we're going to raid into the Alveas channel, and I'm going to spend like pretty much all day. We do need to film a reel in between there at some point. Um, but then I'm going to stream on Alveas today, setting up for the fall carnival. That's the plan. Makes sense? Things to note for the fall carnival is, number one, um, you guys can get tickets. If you donate $25, I made these smile. They're perforated. Um, and if you donate $25 tomorrow, then you will get mailed one of these tickets, and I'm going to sign the bottom of every one of them. Um, so that'll be fun. <laughs> so if you donate $25, you can get a ticket. Um, and then if you donate $250, which is crazy, uh, you guys can get a Polaroid. This is my Polaroid camera. I will be taking pictures, um, Polaroid pictures of the animals and signing them as well. So those are the fundraisers tomorrow. Thank you. They have the two months. They give it the two months. Ugh. All right. Momo's doing better. Um, we can go see him if you want. Okay, let's go outside and then let's talk about how we're doing this. I'm getting so many. I have a bunch of notice. Stand by. Oh, one of them is that I'm live. Thank you. Oh, wow. That's cool. Grumpy Murloc underscore TV resubbed for 22 months. Oh, my God. Wait, yeah, I need to post a Twitch story, you guys. What's wrong? Why are you crying? Oh, God. Oh, wow. Beetle is for my Twitch story. Ew. Okay, she looks crazy. Oh, you're, I know why he's crying. Wait, we have a mission, you guys. Come with me. Pee Wee is only friends with Tripper because nobody else wants to be his friend. I think he would be friends with everyone else, but they don't really let him. Um, I have to get, no, Pee Wee. I have to get Tripper. Hello. Pumpkins. <laughs> Here they are. Um, Chat, we have to go get Tripper. This kid is sad. Um, Tripper and Oatmeal got through the gate when I was driving through, and nobody else. And now Pee Wee's even more lost than usual. Siroc, thank you for the 19 months. Mitch, thank you for the 50 months. Jeez. All right. Ooh. Let's go get the rest of the goats, shall we? Peewee? Where's your friend? <laughs> He's crying. Oh, God. Pee Wee, don't cry. We're gonna go find them. Pee Wee. Ow, bitch! That was me, you idiot. That's how Beetle got me last time, too. She's trying to headbutt Tripper through my legs. 
and did not consider my legs as collateral. Get away from me! Oh my god! Hey! Both of you! You're confusing everybody else! Pee-wee's crying! I got the goats back. Sorry. That's their recall. It's a little loud. Um, okay, back to business. Pumpkins. I'm really scattered today, by the way. I'm like, you ever, okay. This is not it today. Look at her mohawk. You can tell she's pissed because her, her back is all fluffy. Um. I am, I am scattered today, so I apologize if I, if I make no coherent sentences or uh, make any sense all day. Anyway, um, pumpkins, we have three large pumpkins, three small pumpkins. Who do they go to? I know I want to bring a large pumpkin to Winnie, and I want to bring two small pumpkins to the foxes, but I don't know what to do with the rest of them. I'm not still hungover, I don't think. I had, oh my god, dude. I went out on Halloween, and the next day, I was miserable. Look at the little pile. Okay. Small ones, marmosets. I don't think the marmosets would do anything with them. To be honest. No. Miss Repathy, thank you for the five months. Can the marmosets get a small pumpkin? I can give them a small pumpkin, but I don't think they're gonna do anything with it. I think like maybe pee on it. Kayla, Lindsay, what are your opinions for pumpkins? One to the pasture, little ones to foxes. Or should I give a big one to the foxes? Yeah. F105 Darwin Bison, thank you. Um, do you guys want to just start with a big pumpkin for Winnie and go from there? Which ones? Did they? Certainly, I can break it with my fists. Is this one the biggest? I think could, it um, is. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's my... That's the plan. That's the original plan. All right. Is everyone unlocked? Or should I bring keys? Everyone's unlocked with the inside marks. Okay. Hello, beetle. All right, it's a big pumpkin. This is not for you. Wait, I forgot to post on my Twitch story. Oh my God. It's like a child. <clears throat> Please. You know what's stupid about Twitch stories? No offense, Twitch, but like, you can only post them when you're in watch mode. There's like a watch mode and a create mode on mobile. And you, <laughs> you have to, uh, oh! Hey. You have to go in watch mode to create a story. 
Which, like, I don't know. I just feel like... Dude, oatmeal. Do you need to get a spray bottle? Holy shit, flip, oh my god. Maya, what the oh! What are you doing? Space, can you come throw a spray bottle? I think there's one on my desk. Beetle, stop. Bee, stop. Are you gonna be able to make it into the pasture or do you want me to go get a spray bottle? I still haven't been able to find a single Twitch story anywhere. Not in the app, not on PC. Oh, uh, you're gonna make it to the pasture, actually. Yeah, just walk faster. All right, how about you guys fight each other? How about you do that instead? All right. Hello, Stompy. Stompy. This is a pumpkin. Do you like it? I'm gonna put it down, it's heavy. <laughs> God! You post on my freaking Twitch story carrying a pumpkin, I can't do it all at the same time. Okay. Oh my god, I don't like. Okay. A description. Live. Giving animals pumpkins right now. Done. Your story. Okay, it's posting. What well, it says it posted? It's big. All right, Stompy, this is for you. Siren wants it. It's actually not for Stompy. I wanted to give it to Winnie. I didn't think Stompy was gonna care about it. Okay, oh my gosh. One chicken. Horsey. Don't bite me. Don't, you don't have to be so mad. Oh, oh my God. He hates the pumpkin. Okay. I don't know. Stompy. <laughs> Chill out. Horsey. This is for you. What do you think? It's a pumpkin. Do you like it? Happy Halloween. He loves it. Donkeys? Pumpkin? Stompy? Look at this. What's that? Jalapeno. Serrano. Pumpkin. This is about what I expected from the equines. Unamused. Unimpressed. New Prezzo wine about it tweet, tweet dropped. Oh God. Oh my 
my god. Okay. Winnie! Uh. I have something for you. It's a pumpkin. Baby cow. Pumpkin. There you go. She like. Hmm. Delicious. Oh. oh no, not the camera. Hi. Can you see the camera? Hi, Devna. Thank you. Winnie. I'm taking it from right here. Don't kick me. camera. Oh god. <laughs> Smash pumpkin. Winnie, it's leaving. Winnie. Winnie. Stompy. Oh, wait, it actually went really far. Stompy's gonna go get it and bring it back. Okay. Hello. You need to help me break the pumpkin? Winnie, leave the cameraman alone. <laughs> Haunted pause resubbed for three months. I love what you do. Thank you for the three months. Okay, guys, we gotta break this pumpkin so that they're int more interested in it. I figure if I just throw it up in the air, it'll break. You know? Maybe it needs to land on a rock. <laughs> it did break. Stompy, look out. <clears throat> Yeah, I'm a genius. Look, Stomp, pumpkin. Seed, pumpkin seed, yuck. He spat it out. Winnie! This is fine, oh. Winnie! Here you go. A pumpkin for you. It's so heavy. <laughs> Look, there are seeds. Happy Halloween. Delicious. All right, well, she's not interested. Let's try the donkeys. Serrano, Winnie, you're gonna get stuck doing that. You gotta stop doing that. 
go around. Serrano! Donkey! Donk, turn around. Donk! Donkey! Serrano! <laughs> Alright, we're going to this donkey instead. Albino. Look. For you. It's a pumpkin. Dude, this sucks. Everybody hates it. Rosero. Look at this. Look at that. When he's coming back. She's decided that she loves the pumpkin actually. <sighs> All right, Serrano's our last hope in the pasture. Ugh. Serrano! Donkey! Hi! This is for you. I got it for you. Here you go. Come here. It's a pumpkin. Subbed for 22 months. My way in. Preto! Good tweet. Clara underscore the underscore is subbed for 11 Clara. months. Clara! Cat sitting very comfortably around the campfire. You don't like? Okay. Wow. Toast the cat underscore is subbed for 28 months. Maya jammies. <laughs> Toaster, thank you for the 28 months. You didn't see the second tweet? Wait. Dude, Preza, what the fuck? Oh my god. Moving on. Oh, we're just gonna give this to the goats instead. Nobody liked it in the pasture. Actually really hurt my feelings. Daniel, thank you. Where are the other goats? Pito! Come here! Meh! Be 
Thank you for the two months. For the first time in my life, I want to be one of those sheep. These are goats. Pumpkin drama. Do you want part of it? <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> What's she doing? Oh, God, I almost got my eye. Chat, you're in the splash zone. Oh my God. Chat, you're in the splash zone. God, she's so mad all the time. Ew. <laughs> Ew. Saved. Um. <laughs> that's really gross. Well, the goats like it. The goats are fighting. Wow. Reet Judge gifted a tier one sub to people. This is their first gift sub in the channel. What's the song that goes disrespect your surroundings? Chowder said that. Is it this one? What's that song called? Please leave me alone. Okay, too close to me. Why are you guys all saying different songs? I'm shocked you guys don't no, I mean, I don't know, but I'm surprised you guys don't. No! 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 Thank you for the five. No! Oh, shit. Alright, this is actually really sketch. Okay. It is this one. Anyway. Um, all right, chat, we're going to try to walk back up to the studio without dying via goat. Ready? Hey. Over here. Calmly, slowly, exit. Yeah. Long way for me to resub for 13 months. Hey, study time. Thank you for the raid. Hi guys. Hope you had a good stream. Welcome to my stream. We're giving the animals pumpkins today. So far, we're like 2 for 6 or something. Um, only the goats like pumpkins, the cow, the emu, the horse, the the donkeys, they don't like pumpkins. Long way corn eater. Thank you for the sub. Uh, to real Dina, thank you so much for the five. Number B, Daniel, thank you guys for the subs. Do a backflip, I don't know how. Okay. All right. You guys want to do the foxes? Do you guys think, should we give the foxes a big pumpkin or two small pumpkins? Andrew! Thank you for the 20 months. 
Two small pumpkins? Okay. All right, they want to do two small pumpkins. Hello. Guys, this is the this is the haunted rat maze for tomorrow. Check this out. You haven't seen this, isn't that sick? Um, the way that it works, it starts on this side. The way that it works is um, the rats will start over here, and then there are doors to each room, and you guys will solve a riddle. And if you solve the riddle, we'll open this door, and then they'll unlock the next room. Every time you get into a room, you get a prize. Or the rats get a prize. Sometimes they get like a treat <laughs> because you solve the riddle. Um, also, filibuster. Thank you, um, Shorty. Thank you for the prime. Um, if you guys solve, if you're one of the first five people to solve the riddle, then you get points because there's a leaderboard leaderboard for the whole event. And then you have to unlock all the rooms. You have to get to every room, because if you don't get to the last room, then you won't. This is your ticket to the fall carnival. If you don't get here, then you don't get to go. So you better figure the riddles out. Or the stream ends. Leader, leaderboard. Wait, did I say leaderboard? Did I? Yeah. Oh, leaderboard. Sorry, I love birds. What time is the fall carnival tomorrow? It is tomorrow at 11 a.m. CT. My, my normal stream start time. 11 a.m. CT. Uninhibited spooky fun time. Is there a VOD where you explain the fall carnival? I've talked about it a few times, um, but if you don't know what it is, it's a fundraiser um, where chat gets to play a bunch of games like with the animals. Um, so we have bingo with one of our chickens. We have a ring toss versus our crow. Um, we have like a grain eating contest versus our cow. That's for staff, not for chat. You guys don't have to eat anything. Um, and some other fun games that you guys can play with alongside the animals and there will be a point system the whole time. I'm actually really excited. I think it'd be really fun. If you're there for like the whole stream um, and you can like keep track of your points and uh, see yourself on the leaderboard, just like very cool, very fun event. Um, but the whole thing's a fundraiser and it's for fun. Um, and if you donate $25, I drew tickets, like carnival tickets, and I'm gonna sign all those tickets and ship them to you guys, to anyone who donates $25. Uh, if you donate $250, we're doing signed Polaroids. Um, so I'm going to take Polaroid pictures of our ambassadors, sign them, and send them to you. So yeah. Yeah. Hi, Abbott. That's the plan for tomorrow. Hi, Darion. And there are lots of, um, Oliver has an evil wheel, <laughs> which is not a wheel, but like, he's gonna pull consequences out of a, a hat for you guys. Um, stuff that chat has to do, or like, good stuff that chat gets. It's like, we're, we're kind of experimenting to make it as interactive as possible, um, just to see how it goes. There are a lot of moving parts, so everybody pray for space, because <laughs> that poor man is, uh, it just like has so much to do for tomorrow, but he's doing great. He's doing great. Foxes? Time to give the foxes pumpkins. Do you want pumpkin? Finn and Reed. Finn and Reed are American red foxes. Finn's not red. It's because he was bred to be that color. Because he was bred for the pet trade. He was confiscated from the illegal pet trade in California. Now he's here as an ambassador to teach people about why they don't want foxes as pets and why you don't want to wear furs either. I have one pumpkin for each of you. Are you guys ready? And check them out. 
That's nice. <laughs> Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Can you grab it? I don't, oh, maybe I'm, okay. Oh, wow. All right. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about that? Happy birthday, Maya. Thank you, Viper. It's not my birthday. What do you think? Is that pumpkin? Yum. Oh. Is that smart? No, that's... Nothing. Never mind. No ASMR. <laughs> There's fuzz on it, and so he wants to. No, you have what you have. Your own pumpkin. Reed, you want this pumpkin? You can have that one if you want. So this is Reed. Oh, never mind. That was Reed. <laughs> oh my God. Reed, you're gonna have to go get yours again. I'm afraid. It's over there. Connor's here. <laughs> I would like Reed to go past, yeah, and then, then he can go over there and film with Ben. Hun, it's over where you left it. You see? Found it. <laughs> so cute. Oh, nice. Foxes um, scent post, uh, which just means that they and pee and poop on on everything. What does the fox say? So that people other foxes know that it's know that it's theirs it's one of the many reasons that you don't want a fox as a pet in your house cuz they'll scent post all over your house do you want to for 22 months paris thank you do you want to roll that one to him maybe Or to him. <laughs> wow. Nice, dude. Yeah, he got it that time. You're not going to want to touch that now. He peed on it. Is it nice? Are you proud? And itchy? <laughs> it's a very casual itch. Okay, goodbye. A drink. Their coats are looking amazing. I know. Dude, Reed, when he came here, I've never seen a white tip on his tail until this season for Reed. Uh, his tail was, like, super scraggly, um, and his coat was just in really bad shape. Uh, we had to, like, completely shut him out with the vet. Um, so he had, like, this weird mohawk and was, like, pretty much naked on his sides. It was really... Ew. Um, he looked terrible. And now they've been getting salmon oil, um, and we've obviously changed their diet a ton since since they moved here a year ago. Um, and their coats look so good. Um, they're getting really fluffy for winter. Um, and Reed actually has a white tip on his tail, and he actually looks like a fluffy fox. People are saying to break the pumpkin. I'm going to be honest. With pumpkins this small, like, I don't, like, I don't think I can break it with my foot. I can try. Um... 
but like I might need a hammer or something. Hi buddy, I'm just gonna grab this, okay? It's okay, it's okay. Yeah, these things are so hard, there's no way. Okay. Okay, well. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work. Um, I need to like, I don't wanna scare them by like being super loud and like hitting it. I might just leave it. Here you go, Reed. Okay, there you go, Finn. <laughs> cool. Pea pumpkin. It's a good try. Flip stepped on the pea pumpkin. He tried to break it, didn't work. Well, who's next? I think we can leave these in here. I feel okay about leaving these. Um, let me actually, let me ask the girls if that's chill. Um, can I leave the small pumpkins in with the foxes or should I take them out when I leave? You gotta love speech to text, you know. You know, um, let me, I'm gonna wait on a response from them before I leave because I don't know if it's safe to leave them in. I think it is, but there might be something that I'm not thinking about. Oh, I have contacts. I meant to put these in. Should I put them in now that I've touched the pea pumpkin? Okay. <laughs> Who do you guys wanna do next? For pumpkins, we have one small pumpkin and then we have uh, two large pumpkins. Crows. We can try to give the crows a small pumpkin. I, I, they would be scared of the big one. If you, we don't have apes, uh, we have marmosets. Real small primates. Um, all right, Kayla said should be okay. I think so too. Um, if you guys can watch them on the live cams on the Alvarez channel, that would be great. And just let us know if anything weird is happening. But I feel fine about it. <sighs> Kayla feels fine about it, so I feel fine about it. Off we go. You got it. Nice. Okay, let's get a small pumpkin for the crows. Wow. They have the seven months eaten by a whale. <laughs> nice. Okay, have fun with your pumpkins. Pumpkin boys, fox boys, so cute. What if you come back and the foxes have carved them? That would be sick. You guys have seen on TikTok people that like start the patterns for a jack-o'-lantern and then put it in their chicken coop. I think some people have been saying chickens because they want to see that happen, but that happens like over uh, like hours. <laughs> Bread loops, thank you for the 12 months. Um, so I don't know that that would actually be that fun to watch. We can certainly take pumpkin down to the chickens and like see what they do with it. Uh, some like smash pumpkin, I'm sure they'll eat it. Abbott, do you want a pumpkin? 
I'm gonna bring you a pumpkin. Confirmed took 1.5 days for a result. Okay, I'm sorry, not hours, days. <laughs> so if you guys wanna sit here for days, I guess we can do that. Because we know the chickens will love it. Yeah, well we can, we can give some to the chickens to eat. Um, maybe we can just bring a whole one down there. Leave the smashed one for the goats. I'm kind of excited to uh, start decorating today. Um, oh, by the way, I voted this morning. Um, it's the last day for early voting in Texas. It took me 10 minutes, there's nobody there. Um, voting day is November 7th. Uh, we're gonna film a reel today. There's a new resource on Alveas's website um, it's under more if you go to alveasanctuary.org um, or alveas.gg slash vote. Uh, you can link it in chat. That would actually be easier. Um, thank you. And uh, it shows you how to register to vote, how to check if you're registered to vote, how to preview your ballot. Then you can go find your polling location um, and just some advice on what to look for in regards to environmental policy. So if you're looking to vote and you like want to use your vote um, to benefit our natural world, uh, there's a little bit of information on the website now that is a new feature. Um, so shout out to Matt and PJE for, for that one. Oh boy. We're trial running the rat maze. She's trying to fit under, she oh. doesn't oh. she doesn't fit. Oh. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we need we need Shift some is too towels. Bad. She can't fit. <laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna practice that troubleshoot a little bit perhaps you're not supposed to be up there incorrect no mail no no mail how do you plan on getting them from this side to that side um <laughs> that's a great question i should have put a door here and i did not um excellent Yeah, and then I can put, I can put this here. Do you not try to murder yourself, ma'am? Chips? Use the ladder. No. <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. Girl. Hi. Hi, how are you? <laughs> oh, this way. Yay, look, chips, you can go, okay. <laughs> chaos. Pure chaos. Use the ladder. Nope, not this way. Tips. You're trying to. You were trying. You were trying to. Eat snacks. Eat yourself. <laughs> Do not eat yourself. <laughs> 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 it worked for a bit, and then they're like, gone. <laughs> Use your door. Okay. That's not the door. Use your door. Use the door. The door. Okay. <laughs> The door. Yay! <laughs> Good job! You used the door. Nope. Oh! <laughs> we need a lid. Um. This is how it's going. <laughs> Over to the behind the scenes chat. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Alright, let's go to Crows. <laughs> it's looking great. It's looking. Our, our prep is looking great. It's gonna be great. I don't think a blanket or towel over the top would matter. Um, sorry, Otis. Uh, I think they would just do the same thing. Hello. Connor's here. It's gonna go fine. It's gonna go fine. They just like exploring, maybe. 
because they're spending some time in there today, they will uh, kind of like get over it and not feel like exploring as much and then they'll chill out. Maybe. Pippin, thank you for the sub. Okay, keep in mind, you guys, crows are cautious with a W. So, there's a very good chance they will be afraid of this. Very afraid of this. When you bring something new into the crow enclosure, um, they think that it's a bomb. Okay, they don't, that's a joke. They don't think that, but they are afraid of it. And so, I predict that we will put this on the ground. Abbott will take a while to come down. He'll come down to it, he'll circle it like 10 times uh, and look at it like this and look at it like very suspicious. Uh, and probably hate it and then we'll have to leave. That's my guess for what's gonna happen. Abbott? I have something for you. This is for you. It's a pumpkin. Come on. This. Okay, he came down faster than I thought. The circling has begun. Other direction? <laughs> There's a pumpkin. Oh, he made contact. That's huge. Scratch. You ever seen a crow scratch their head? <laughs> You'd think they'd go on the other side of the wing. Pumpkin. Come here. I don't want to touch it or move it because then it'll become a completely different object and he'll be afraid. Depleted, thank you. Coconut is not going to come down here. Wow. For 12 months. Jacqueline, thank you for the year. Abbott! Abbott! Whoa! Come here! That was a weird way to land. Oh my god. He's on the ground? Coconut, you want a pumpkin? Oh my god. I can move it over there. Guys, I know, okay, coconut is molting. Please don't make fun of him right now. Wow, buddy, hi. You're so brave. You're so brave! This, is, this is, would be insane if you like... I'm shocked he's out here. 
Um, Coconut was, uh, did have a leg injury when he was very little. Um, and so you might notice he walks kind of funny. Um, he has been on, oh my God, on meloxicam pain medication. Um, and he's been doing better with that leg. Um, but it's a little harder for him, I think, when it gets colder. And again, he's molting, and that's why he looks like that. It's part of the reason that coconut's non-releasable is because of his leg injury. Guys, this is so rare. I don't know if I would start from there. Stick. <laughs> wow, coconut, good job. Oh. Uh, investigate. Uh, has come so far. Have it. GG, buddy. He has, yeah. Uh. Coconut's a little smaller than Abbott. They're both American crows. Um, and they both were born in Central Texas. You okay? Um, they were both born in Central Texas, not from the same nest, uh, but from the same area. Um, they were both blown out of their nest by a storm and um, were found by people. And then they were rehabilitated by people as well. Yeah, that's fair. Um, rehabilitated by people as well, and then they imprinted. Um, and imprinting is an irreversible change that happens in their brain, of birds' brains, um, when they're babies. It's why ducklings follow adult ducks. It's how they identify with the species, and so that's how they learn how to take care of themself, um, themselves. What to eat, and how to migrate, and how to court mates, and what to be afraid of, and when birds imprint on humans, um, it makes it really, really <laughs> unlikely that they can be released and successful as wild birds again. So Coconut and Abbott both imprinted on humans as babies, unfortunately. Um, and that's why they're <laughs> under human care. Hi, bud. What do you think? What is wrong with their feathers? Coconut is molting. Um, so he looks like he exploded. Um, and then Abbott is missing some neck feathers because they pick at each other's neck feathers. Do you want this stick? Okay. I'm gonna put it in the ground. Okay. What if I... You poke a hole in it. The pumpkin, um, not, I don't have a knife on me, so I don't really have anything. Do you? I don't think I can do it with a stick. I'm using tools. Yeah, give me that. Sorry about your car key. It's fine. Okay, there's now a small hole. I love your goats, Maya. Especially people of feeling of it. There you go. Thank you. Thank you for the five. Especially Beetle and Peeling the Nugget. His name is Pee Wee. <laughs> and his name, his name is Pee Wee McNugget. Ah, ah, ah. 
it. Stop screaming. Well, do you guys want to go see what the marmosets do with this? Little pumpkin? Mate, perhaps. The crows have done their investigating, it seems. Triple E at a four hundred and twenty donated five dollars. I also love peeling the nugget. His name's not peeling the nugget. Where did that come from? Oh, the marmosets are locked, actually. I don't have a key. I do not have a key, and the marms are locked. So, never mind. I also, yeah, I think they're inside. I don't see monkeys. Um, what are we gonna, oh, we're gonna go to the chickens, huh? I'm gonna go to the chickens. Should I, you guys want me to pre-break the pumpkin when I go to the chickens? Everyone seems really insistent that I'm like opening pumpkins for people. By people, I mean animals. I will say, with like, cause we have so many birds, um, not just birds, with the animals. Like, it's more like, here you can play with this. I don't want them eating like a whole pumpkin, you know? It's, it's like too much. <laughs> um, and their produce gets, like the macaws, right? Their produce gets weighed out every day. So like, they can't eat this whole pumpkin. It's like days worth of produce for them. So that's crazy, we don't wanna do that. Same with the crows. Crows get their produce weighed out as well. Um, so it's more as it's more like a toy, you know? You know what I mean? The chickens don't get their produce weighed out. Um, they can eat a lot of produce. Same with the goats. Um, so I think they're fine. So we can give a big one to the chickens if you want. I'll bring a knife with me. Um, There are rats on the floor. Yep. Big pumpkin. Okay, I'm gonna get a knife really quick. Hi, be doe. Hi, be doe. No goats in the studio. No flip in the studio. Don't cry. Hello. You know what I'm also gonna get? It's a spray bottle. All right. Abby doll. Beep. Beep. Should I take Polaroids right now? Sure. Right. If I remember how to, I can figure it out. I have, I'll try to do it. Guys, you want to try to take a Polaroid? Beetle, you want to be in a Polaroid? Surely I can just, No, Beetle. I do, I open this. Yes. You ever use these for? Seems easy enough. 
Pido. No. Pido. No. Come here. Oh, you're too close. <laughs> Oh wait, the first one's blank. <laughs> Damn it! Okay, we gotta go again. Stay. Ready? No, no. Pito! This is the first Polaroid, unless it's bad. Then I take it back. Which side does it even show up on? It says don't put in mouth. You hear that? I don't think so. I think it's like a myth. I also think you're supposed to limit sun exposure. Big out! <laughs> I put it in my pocket. <laughs> Saved. Oh, it's showing up? What is that? Oh no, that's that's Beetle. Yeah, that's Beetle. <laughs> it's Beetle. <laughs> it's good. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, come with me. Look, oh, I'm not leaving this here for her. Okay. No beetle in here, no beetle. So tomorrow, if you donate 250, then I will take these Polaroids and then go here and I will sign them with a smiley face, um, and send them to you. So this one's gonna go to one of y'all. <laughs> you are welcome. That's a good, that's a good picture. Yeah. <laughs> I love it. Okay. Excellent. Excellent. All right, let's go, uh, Let's go to the chickens. Hey, Beetle, you did a good job. <laughs> I'll pass on that one. That's really mean. It's really mean. I think it's good. Um, I know 250 is. Hi, bud. The goats killed Flip. Sorry, guys. Chickens? I have something for you. Can you see it again? Jeez. Still there? No, it's 
six. It's coming up, but it's like six hundred. I don't have bandwidth for tech issues today. Yeah, now it's just going down again. I don't know. I'm just turning it off. I'm turning it back on. Thank you. Hello? Cringe. Sorry. Did you put the lock on there? No. Okay, cool. <laughs> <sighs> All right, you guys. You can see again. Welcome back. Um, chickens, I brought you something. That's for you. <laughs> I think they're scared of it. Are you scared? He's approaching. Pumpkin! Come here, buddy. He's approaching. She's approaching. Wow. Uh, boy, Blue, you oh. subbed for 10 months. What is that? Blue, thank you for the 10 months. Pumpkin. You can eat it. <laughs> that beep was Mia, by the way, if you heard that. Everybody hates pumpkins except for the goats. They've demolished that pumpkin that we left up there, by the way. It's like all over the place in pieces. Pumpkin, wow. Parrot 43 resubbed for three months. Hey, Maya and chat. Hi. Thank you for the three months, Parrot. Look at that. Look, there's a piece. A pumpkin. Pumpkin, wow. Nemocra sub for 35 months. Ooh. Beep, beep. Pumpkin Maya, he 4K. Do you like? He likes it. 
me up. Look, that whole thing is made of that. Do you understand? Mia? Mia? Oh, God. Pumpkin. 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 Mia. Mia. They're afraid. Yeah. I'm kind of sick of all you guys telling me to cut it open. Okay, it's kind of pissing me off if I'm being honest. It's a whole day, all day. Mia. Maya has a knife. Why did she use car key? Because I just got the knife. Hi. Let's leave this in here with them and then go see the parrots. Open it and give them, I'm gonna go offline, I swear to God. All right, let's go see the parrots. Let's go see the parrots. Beachy one resubbed for 12 months. They don't know what to do with it. Why not? Dude, you guys. How about, you get, you can get chickens and you can open pumpkins for your chickens, okay? You can do whatever you want. It's like not that serious. They don't have to eat the pumpkin. Hello. Wow, that's really nice. That's really nice. Thank you. Mia, are you talking a lot? You were talking a lot when we were over there. Now you're not going to say anything, probably. That's how she rolls. Uh, what? Hello, Birdie. Hello, Birdie. Siren. That was really close. Soybeansy resupped for six months. Alvius Mia. Siren. You want to sing? You say, yo ho. Hoist the colors. Uh, oh. Okay. Okay. Evo. Do, do, do. Hello, Birdie. Hello, Birdie. <laughs> she's talking about. I don't know. There she is! Hi! Little bird! Hello? Hello! Wow! Here she is! Oh. Pretty boy. You're a girl, but... Whatever. 
Quack. Do you want to sing? You say, yo, ho. Siren plushies are still available if you want a siren plushie. Um, you can get one. You can do command plush, I believe. Wow. Hush Patera, thank you for the 53 months. Birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Good job. That's nice. That's nice. What are you doing? What are you doing? Mia. Hi. Hi, what are you doing? I want one now. You probably don't. Um, parrots, this parrot in particular, this is a blue fronted Amazon. Um, she can live 50 to 60 years in captivity. Um, they're extremely loud, like above the threshold for um, hearing loss from prolonged exposure, just below the threshold for pain, but I can personally attest uh, it does hurt uh, if you're close enough to them. And so having them in a house would be really, really tough. Um, and, oh, I meant the plush. <laughs> Never mind. I'll shut up. Uh, they also chew through wood, though, um, which is another reason you don't want them. Uh, but she's doing a really great job at demonstrating why you don't want one of these in your house, because you'd absolutely lose your mind. Yeah, because you're really loud. Sea shanty? You want a sea shanty? Your birthday shanty? Siren was learning a sea shanty, but she only knows the words to happy birthday, so she combines them. Don't cry, because I don't want you to come on my shoulder to make a hole in my sweatshirt. That's nice. Happy birthday. Uh, 
Siren might start screaming when we give Mia attention, just a warning. Mia, how you doing? Oh, that's so nice. Are you excited because the fall carnival is tomorrow? Yay, tomorrow! Happy birthday, Siren. It's another reason you don't want to pair it. It's nice. Um, another reason you don't want to pair it. Uh, you have to pay attention to them. You must. And if you do not, they will cause you hearing damage. <laughs> I've made no progress with the pumpkin. I'm a little disappointed, but I understand. We'll come back for the pumpkin. Imagine working from home and there's a siren in your office. Dude, I've thought about that before. You couldn't. Like, you could not be in a meeting. If she started doing that when you were in a meeting, like, you, you straight up could not talk. And you can't get her to stop either um, if she doesn't want to. So... It's actually like super unrealistic <laughs> scenario to have them in your house. Same with like neighbors. If you have an apartment, oh my God. Hello chicken. Hello baby cow. Guys, the donkeys got let out yesterday for the first time um, for like an enrichment walk. They walked around here. Oh gosh, they're really doing damage over here. Arisa cart 99 resub for six months, hog pumpkins. Thank you for the six months. Look at that. Good job, guys. I don't know how they got all the pieces like that. Hello. Peewee. You guys want some pumpkin ASMR? Wow. Texas 1505 is up for 42 months. Thank you for the 42 months. Zephyr, thank you for the 34 months. Look, Pee Wee's eating pumpkin. Pee Wee, you're not eating pumpkin, you're eating rocks. I need to give him a piece of pumpkin. Pee Wee, look. Do you want pumpkin? Do you want to eat? Do you understand? No. He's leaving. Well, 
What time is it? I do not know. It is. It is. One o'clock. Um, cool. I am going to uh, raid into Alveus right now. Um, we will stay on this stream for a bit. Um, so don't go anywhere. Space, if you want to start the raid, that would be great. Um, today on the Alveus channel, I'm going to be setting up for the Fall Carnival all day. So I have like a whole set to build in the studio. Um, so we'll do that on stream. Uh, I have a couple other, I don't know. I have a bunch of stuff I need to figure out where to put. And then, yeah, that's the plan. And we got to film a reel. Um, I can do my part on stream. I don't mind, but I don't want the girls to have to do their part on stream. Don't go anywhere, damn it. Look, it's a little dope. What? I still don't know what the reel is. Uh, it's to mobilize voters to get people to go vote. We're having you and Kayla? Uh, I think me, Kayla, Lindsay. No, but I have a script written. This is so annoying. This goat. Stop leaning into me. You guys are reading off different parts of the script? Yeah. I'll show you. It should be easy. Um, it does require different ambassadors, though. Um, we'll have to move to enclosures. Do, do. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! <laughs> That's my siren impression. Okay. Hello. Hi. Can. can Okay. Do you like the beetle Polaroid? Did you see it? It's a beetle, so it's okay. It's so good. Look, it's developed. Do you think that's good photography? Mm -hmm. Thank you. He's got it's good photography. Huh. Where's the raid? Did you start a raid? No, I did not. Oh. Whoops. All right, guys. Now we're going to start the raid. <laughs> Does someone want this, this Polaroid with nothing on it? you are here I'm going to print out my script and we should probably do it now and then come back into the stream this is it so there's a here. we have this new web page that says like how to vote where to vote whatever I voted nice me too and then there's these so it's like siren wants leaders who will do like siren can't vote but whatever so that's the that's the script is georgia can't vote but he wants leaders who will protect waterways for frogs amphibians and people siren and then reed um so i think kayla can do reed maybe Lindsay can do siren unless siren's being cringe she can probably feed her the whole time maybe be fine i don't know um, and then I'll just do a, a closing thing where it's like, where I say your vote can be a voice for the wildlife that doesn't have one. So you're going to do opening and closing and reading the body? Yeah. Cool. Hey, you're on. I'll see you. You want me to go get the other camera right now? Yeah. 
You guys want to do a bingo stress test? Hello. Yes. All right. Wicked. Whoa. Yes, Yak. Thank you for the five. Big time. Monitor hat. Russell, thank you for the, the tier one. ESN, thank you. Mask. Thank you for the five. Super duper hat, thank you for the five. Hat. Super duper just gifted five subs. Thank you for the five. Okay. Um. I wonder what order we want to do this in. Mm. And like, all right, let's check out the bingo. Do you guys have your bingo cards? Thank you for the bits. Um, Flip, do you think it matters which one of these we start with? Between Georgie, Reed, and Siren? Maybe we should start with Reed. Uh, it doesn't really matter if we're just going to put them as like, they have I mean, like, in order of how it's edited, not necessarily filmed. Oh, edited? It is, I mean, it's all about the script, right? So, like, you know, have the script in certain directions. Right. I'm trying to think, like, if Siren is one of these, if I need to do Siren, because if I give her, like, a pistachio so she's not screaming the whole time, mm -hmm. um, it has to be, like, one take. Um, I mean, Siren, Siren is screaming the whole time on the other one. Right, but we. And then everybody was like, "I can't believe you got Siren to not talk." I know, it's <laughs> funny. I was like, oh yeah, totally not talking. I just spent ten hours on the audio. Well, that's the other thing is we don't have that kind of time now. Yeah, but that'd be the whole thing. That'd be like ten things. It would be way easier. Hmm. It also doesn't have to be Siren. It can be. It can be Mia. Twenty-two. Even if we are like interacting with Mia, Siren too. Six. Screaming. Well, we'll have multiple people in there, so she won't. Seventy-four. Damn it. Scott Thatch, thank you for the sub. Eleven, sick. Ten, damn it. Twenty-nine, damn it. Thirty-five. Um. Okay. I need to talk to Kayla and Lindsay and see which ones of these they want to do. Um.
70. Just resubscribe for five months. Thank you for the five months. Um, chat, do you guys want to go to um, cams while we film this reel and you play bingo? And then I'll come back and, and set up on the Alvea's channel. Okay, I will be right back. You're going to waste the raid. Thank you for your advice, Josh. Um, Flip is here right now, and I don't want him to wait three hours while I hold the raid. Um, and just, like, sit here. Huh? I can do my part on stream. I don't want them to have to do theirs on stream. Because that's unfair. Um, so Scathatch, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. It's not a waste. The cams are great. What are you about? Chatter just pissed me off today. I'm not in it today. I'll be back, you guys. Have fun playing bingo.